Hi, my name is Byron Udell. I'm the founder and CEO of AccuQuote.com. We're one of the nation's largest life insurance brokerage firms. The topic today is identifying factors that affect life insurance premiums. Common sense would tell you that a life insurance company is going to charge you a rate that's based upon the likelihood of dying. So any factor that affects your likelihood of dying is going to affect the rate on a life insurance policy. The most obvious are medical impairments. If you're a diabetic, your lifespan is probably shorter than someone who's not a diabetic. If you smoke cigarettes, if you're overweight, if you do risky stuff like wingsuit flying and base jumping and r riding bulls and rodeos and things like that, those are all factors, ra racing cars, anything lifestyle-wise or medically that affects your mortality or your likelihood of dying and your lifespan will affect the rate on your life insurance policy. So life insurance companies in their process of evaluation called underwriting are going to ask you questions and do the best they can to determine where you stand medically and where you stand from a lifestyle standpoint. Sometimes they ask questions that seem like they would not be relevant, like do you have a lot of moving violations, which might be a question that you would expect to be asked when you buy car insurance, but not necessarily for life insurance. But life insurance companies ask that question because if you have a lot of moving violations and you run through red lights all the time and you're speeding in your car all the time, you're a whole lot more likely to wrap your car around a telephone pole and die, which is something that's going to affect your rate on life insurance. So those are the kinds of questions that you're going to be asked. Those are the kinds of things that affect the price of your life insurance. I hope this was helpful. My name is Byron Udell. I'm the CEO and founder of AccuQuote.com. We're one of the nation's largest life insurance brokerage firms.